exclusive. An HPD SWAT team has arrested the suspect accused in the intentional murder of a nine-year-old little girl in the Heights. Jeremiah Jones was arrested around 6 p.m. Tuesday in a parking lot near Spring. Houston police said he's charged with capital murder and aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. Nine-year-old Kylie Sorrell died after she and her mother had been shot during a domestic disturbance late Monday night. Her mom, Brittany Sorrell, said that the Winsdorf Village Elementary School student was a good basketball player who loved to make TikTok videos. She was also in a program with the Houston Police Department. This senseless act the domestic violence hits home for me and the HPD family. That sweet child was a student and a member of our Police Activities League. Police Chief Troy Fenner said, Please pray for this angel and her mother and the rest of their families. Monday night shooting happened just before 10 p.m. at a third floor apartment at Camden Heights just off Oxford Road. Houston Police Department were responding to a domestic disturbance call involving Sorrells and Jones. When officers arrived, they found Kylie shot in the head and Brittany with a gunshot wound to the shoulder. Little Kylie was pronounced dead at the hospital. The mother was treated at the hospital and later released. Sorrells was at the apartment with her three children at the time of the shooting, a seven-year-old little girl and a one-year-old little toddler. Sorrell was living with a male cousin at the time who was downstairs talking to a friend when her ex-boyfriend showed up at the apartment. The victim had dated the suspect for eight months, but the relationship ended two months ago. Sorrell's already reported Jones to the police and said that she was scared of him and she wanted him to stay away from her. Jones was already out on bun for a felony possession of a firearm at the time of the incident. At the time of the shooting, the three girls were inside a bedroom watching TV when the suspect came in and was upset that the mother might be talking to another man since their breakup. The suspect was said to have went wild in the house. The suspect then ripped the TV off the wall and left the bedroom. The mother followed him into the living room as they continued to argue. The man asked for her phone and then became more upset about her messaging someone. That's when the suspect ran back into the bedroom and fired two shots. He came back and pointed the gun at the mother's face and then made her get on the ground. The suspect started shooting again, hitting the mother in the shoulder, and then he took off in his car. The mother ran to her daughters and found Kylie laying on the ground. She called 911. Sorrell's younger daughters were not injured. Jones's brother showed up at the scene and said he was wrongfully accused and has an alibi. This is the second deadly shooting involving an innocent child in Houston less than 24 hours. A seven-year-old boy just died Sunday night in an unrelated drive-by shooting in East Harris County. Three teens were also shot overnight by a gunman in a ski mask. They're expected to survive. Domestic and family violence cases in the Houston area have increased at an alarming rate. Victims often suffer in silence because they feel scared, helpless, or ashamed. So here we have a nine-year-old little girl who lost her life because her mother decided to move on with her life or her mother was being sneaky and dating another man behind her ex's back, probably promising him that they were going to get back together. He found out about it when he looked through that phone and couldn't take what he saw. And the little nine-year-old girl paid with her life. Sad, sad situation. Until next time.